Hi there, fifth wheel owners. Today we're going to be taking a look at More Ride's line of rubber pin boxes. The rubber pin boxes for More Ride offer a much smoother driving experience when hauling your fifth wheel trailer. There are several rubber bushings and shear pins in here that allows movement of our fifth wheel trailer while keeping our pin box here where it attaches to the kingpin, keeps that static down here. And it's able to do this using all the various rubber bumpers inside as well as the shafts here that make sure that everything is going to stay all together. We're now gonna take it out onto our test course. First, we're gonna hit our uneven bump section. That's gonna mimic a pothole. Next, we're gonna hit our even bump section. That's gonna mimic going over a speed bump. And then we're gonna see what it's like when we do like a hard turn. We're gonna go ahead and turn around right here, put it under a nice turn. You can see it still turns just like a normal pin box would. While driving this, the performance benefits seem very similar to an air ride pin box. What I've noticed though is those air ride pin boxes, you do have to air them up. There is a little bit of maintenance there because the pressure does change as temperatures change. So you do have to just keep an eye on those. Whereas something like this is a completely maintenance free option due to the rubber pads. The pads are replaceable. So if over time, maybe many years of service, they start to wear down a little bit, you can replace them. Up at front, we have a crush bumper here. There's also one just like this located in the back. And this is really for when you're stopping and starting and only if it's a, an extreme movement because it will slide on these shafts. The trailer will slide forward. And as it does, this bumper here will contact on the surface up here if you do have enough forward motion. So like it's a, maybe an emergency stop. You slam on the brakes and the trailer goes up. This bumper is going to hit here. All these components are going to absorb that impact. So you're not going to feel it nearly as much as you would if you just had a solid pin hooked up to your truck. It would just be boom, it would be very abrupt. Something like this is going to help absorb that impact. But we do also have our shear spring down inside here that allows for movement as well. That shear spring is kind of the, the most magic part of the assembly. That's what determines the amount of weight that the pin box is rated for. Our glide pads here are a self-lubricating material and these allow it to slide easily on this surface. You can almost see it kind of here. This one's been out in service for a while and you can kind of see how it's nice and shiny in this location here where the puck does glide on this. So it helps support that weight up so the shear spring can do its job properly dampening the movement. Because the main pur purpose of getting a rubber pin box like this is to smooth out your ride to help reduce chucking and jerking whenever you take off and whenever you stop. It really does help to absorb a lot of that. The movement that we do have available here will have about three inches of forward and backward movement and about an inch and a half of side to side movement. Not so much side to side, it's mainly that forward and backward because it's mostly starting, stopping. That is where it's really gonna make a huge difference in the feel of your trailer. You're not gonna feel like, again, every time you take off, like you're lugging this big load, it kind of eases it in. So you can just take off and it feels much smoother. And then when you come to a stop, it's not like you have all this weight just barreling and pushing on you. It kind of absorbs a lot of that and it's just a much smoother operation that just overall is gonna give you more control over your trailer because you're just gonna feel like you have more control. You're not gonna be as tired and gripping the wheel as much. Just really overall is just gonna smooth things out and give you a little more energy when you get to your destination and overall be more comfortable for all of your passengers. There's a few things to keep in mind when determining the pin box for your trailer. There are various different ratings for the more ride pin boxes and also the fits. You'll wanna know the make of your trailer. You'll wanna know the trailer's weight rating, not the pin boxes rating that you currently have. You don't want to use that, you want to know how heavy your trailer is. And you'll be using those to help determine which replacement more ride is going to be for your trailer. And that completes our look at More Ride's line of rubber pin boxes.